What is up guys, Pie Muffin here, and we are back with another Tales of Arise video. So, last time we finished all our side questing and making it through the cave, and we finally made it to the demo area, as I'm going to call it. This is the section we got to play through in the demo in Eldum Manancia. Um, the only real difference is, one, we don't have Doholim and Krasara yet in this area, and two... We are not the same level as we were in the demo. In the demo, you're level 25 for your whole party, and here we're still level 18 and 17. I might be under-leveled a little bit, because a lot of the enemies in this area are like 19 and 20, and then I don't know if it's a chance on every fight or just a specific fight on that top hill you can see over there, but for whatever reason, when I was fighting some of these boars, a giant, like, bird dragon thing just popped down that was level 26 and ruined the fun, so I had to run away from that fight. Uh... So, that was definitely an experience, but, uh, now, we are right outside of whatever this town is, and we're gonna grab this side quest right in front, which I'm assuming is the same side quest you have to do in, uh, the demo, where you have to go kill a monster. I don't think it's gonna be the same monster, considering the Mantis is back in Calaglia, unless we're just gonna fight two Mantises. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna get that, and we're gonna get moving, so let's do that. This area is much different than it was in the demo. Like, there's a lot of stuff that's kind of uh, much different. But actually, I do want to go up here first and see if there's like a hidden treasure chest or something. Hopefully that damn bird won't show up again. Teamwork makes the dream work. Oh, and yeah, we, now we have that gauge, so the more uh, fights we do in a row, the more XP we're going to get. Um... It's like there's nothing secret back here. Let's disrupt that. Glimmer Dragon! Works for me. Alright, we're gonna fight these guys, and then we'll go ahead and see what that quest is. Ooh, lemons! I think that's actually what we need for the EXP, uh, recipe. Ooh, a four-star earth stone. Um, another thing that I find interesting is I feel like leveling in Arise is much slower than a normal Tales game. I feel like at 20 hours into the game, uh, I'm normally higher than level 18. Like, I'm still expecting, like, most Tales games between level, like, 60 and 70 for, like, the end of the game, or, like, 50 to 70 at least. But, uh, you never know. Um, it really just depends how long this game is. Because I still am trying to, like, because I like to try and figure things out early, but, of course, you know, the twist in the game is going to throw everything for a loop. But 
you know, obviously the goal is to defeat the five lords. Uh. <laughs> but, um, what's after that? Like, do we just defeat the five lords? Simple, you know, our planet is saved type thing? I doubt it. There's obviously going to be more. We're obviously going to leave the planet, I would assume. Uh, I think it would be very disappointing if we didn't at least go to Rena at least once. Um, but I guess we'll have to wait and see. So, let's go over here. Cows, sheep, people. Rat pigs. If, if I was okay, I wouldn't be lying here. Now would I? Yeah, just about. Well, at any rate, I sure can't move. Maybe this is some sort of sign. Say, kid, mind helping this old geezer out? Sure, why not? I was hoping you'd bring me back to my home. Oh, is that it? I can do that. We were just heading toward... No, not that way. My hope is in the opposite direction of the city. It is? Well, oh well, we've come this far. I guess I'll get you back home. Nice to know there's still some good souls these trying times. I see a lot of promise in you, kid. Yeah, I'm nothing special. Just try my best, old man. I should mention my backers, too. Can I ask that you carry me as well? Yeah. <laughs> Figured that would be the case. <sighs> what, tired already? I expect you better from you. Still, I appreciate it, kid. If you haven't come along, I've been z zoogle food for sure. <sighs> Don't mention it. Still, you're heavier than you look. What do you eat, old timer? Ha, huh, good <gasps> question. Name's Bogdal. I run this ranch, which always keeps my old stomach full of nothing else. <laughs> you don't know what a ranch is, boy? Where do you think all that food you eat come in town comes from point being folks like me are the ones who do the supply who supply the food everyone eats Don and Zarinans alike anyway I, I owe you something for helping me get back here in one piece <laughs> you don't have to do that it's fine oh hush I just need to figure out what I don't got a lot to spare around here I know y'all can make use of this ranch here as much as you like this livestock here will be yours heck I'll even help look after him how's that mm -hmm. sound that's a nice offer. I don't know the first thing about raising animals. You'll be fine. Trust me. You got the face of the animals will love, and I'm sure you can take care of them. Is this really happening? <laughs> you can raise li livestock for cooking ingredients. Place the livestock you want and raise the barn. To raise in the barn and give them feed. You can give them paid feed to, incre to raise more of them faster. You gain ingredients for your livestock over time. Okay. Law, caretaker. Uh, okay. Cool. 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 Well, at least we have access to this place now. So how do we raise the livestock, or get livestock to begin with? We have a dog. And a cat. Oh, okay, raise livestock. Send to barn. Cow. Okay. Chicken. And uh, pig.
We got all kinds of dogs and cats here. Well, I guess this will be something you just do over time. Alright, well, I guess the side quest wasn't what I thought it was. So I wonder if there really isn't that, uh... Well, before I say anything, let's see first. Uh, oh wait, no. This is the way we want to go. Guess it won't hurt to look around the corner. That was an odd noise. I don't see this guard posted out here, so I wonder if... Yeah, I wonder if we're just allowed to go in. Looks like that is going to be the case. Alright, well... I guess we're heading into the city. Wow. It looks like the Donnans and the Renans coexist here, though. The city looks fancy. Vicent. Wow. Definitely the biggest city we've seen. レナ人の街なのか。こんな大勢のレナなんて初めて見たぜ。いや、コアが見えた。つまり皆だな。どれだ。それに笑顔だ。気をつけろ。何かおかしい。失礼。皆さんはこのエリベメナンシアの外からやってきた方々とお見受けしますが、そんな怖い顔をしないでください。私はドラシン。民生局で働いているダナ人です。民生局？住民
Look at this place. Wow. Um. The Vicente, the capital city of Elder Manancia, a beautiful, verdant, peaceful city of life. The most beautiful landmark is Otelina Palace, the manor of Lord Duhul. Do they, 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 in Japanese, they were calling him Duhalim, or whatever. Dohalim. Uh, his policies have ensured we can live our lives free of oppression. Okay. It sure is. It's what set the city apart. We're technically, we're still technically slaves, but we get paid fairly for our work. So everyone's happy to work. The marketplace is booming, and worries about what, where food or lodgings come from is a thing of the past. This is a result of Lord Dohalim's reforms. Yeah, but wouldn't that mean when his, like, service is over, like his 10 years, that, you know, the person that would replace him would just be bad again? Is there where we can rest? Oh, you must be tired along the road. Go up the stairs behind me, and you'll find an inn straight to your right. They've always got a barker girl off front, so it should be hard to miss. The beds are there are great, so I highly recommend staying there at least once. Okay. Oh, and uh, here we got side quests. <laughs> we got plenty of them. All right, well, let's at least pick these up. See if we can get some of them done as well. Mm. Excuse me, sir. You appear to be a stranger to these parts, yes? Oh. Yeah, we came in from out of town. Why? I apologize for the sudden proposition, but you wouldn't happen to have any granite fangs on your person, would you? They come from the tusks of the boar zoogles you can find outside of town. You're looking for zoogle tusks? How come? To make weapons out of them? Oh, nothing like that. You see, those tusks change color when they detect poison. Eating utensils made from those tusks are quite popular at Tenant Palace. I was hoping to stock up on more of them. What, is someone worried they're being poisoned? Rena is a society that respects its hierarchy. It's hard for me to imagine anyone trying to poison a noble. Likewise, we've never heard of such a thing uh, taking place. However, it's tradition at the palace to offer the tusks as something of a curio? I've never heard of that word before. Uh, if someone wants to leave a comment and let me know what it means, because I'm probably not going to remember this. Uh, yeah, I've never heard of that word before. I tried to ask the guards for their assistance, but unfortunately appear to be occupied with more pressing matters. Hence, if you would have any granite fangs, I wish you hand... Okay. Yes. We don't happen to have any right now, but you said they come off of boar zoogle fangs. Mm -hmm. Correct. If you could bring me some, you'd be doing me a huge favor. I promise to compensate you for all your effort. So I assume he's a, a Donan, right? Yeah, he's got the stone on his hand. Is he... Can you get your brain off of weapons for five seconds? Seriously, I can't be the only person that, that's, like, feeling this, like, Disney vibe with this city. Um... How? Where? I hear a cat. Okay, now I hear it. I feel like this is probably going to be the biggest city in the game. Realistically. Oh, there you are. Halo. Goodbye, owl. Um, all right, there's one side quest here and then one down here. They're both down the same corridor, it seems. Oh, well. <laughs> I take you folks for all travelers. It's so wonderful to have you all here. You really don't bat eye at us being the air, do you? Even though we have arena with us? Are you surprised? I suppose it might not be a common sight elsewhere on Donna, but here in Vicente, it's part of everyday life. Hey, if we want to visit the palace, do we keep going this way? <laughs> Yes, that's exactly right. Although, if you ask me, the training grounds might be more up your alley, since you all appear to be of that persuasion. Training grounds, you say. Is that code for some kind of arena where you make complete strangers fight and kill one another for sport? No, absolutely not. It's nothing terrible at that. 
Training gowns are what they sound like. It's three years ago. It used to be a really gruesome place where slaves had to fight each other, as well as vicious zoogles. But when our current lord, Lord Dohalim, came to power, one of the first things he did was put a stop to such an awful spectacle. You're telling me Irene and Lord did that? The place was refurnished and reopened as a proper place to train where it's known for these days. It's mainly designed to be the Elder Manantia Guard, or used by the Elder Manantia Guard, but it's open to anyone who wishes to use its facilities. Anyone even Donnans? Of course, the arena is far too punishing for me, but if you're looking to hone your skills, I recommend you pay a visit. Pay as well, I guess. Interesting that we actually have a Colosseum in this game. Zestiria didn't have one, and I don't believe Berseria had one either. I guess the Zillias would be the last time, which means it's been like a decade since we've had a Colosseum in a Tales game. Oh. I gather you guys came here along the highway, yeah? You didn't happen to run into that thing along the way, did you? What thing? I'm talking about the huge Zoogle. Oh, yeah, we did. They're uh, around the skies, occasionally dropping down to attack both people and Zoogles alike. It attacks even Zoogles? No, that's something you don't meet every day. Yeah, this guy's really something. Even the uniforms here have a hard time dealing with it. I've even tried putting a bounty on to sweeten the pot, but you could say. But everyone's just about given up on it. In that case, we'll handle it. I'm sure we'll find a way to get rid of it. You really think you have what it takes? I mean, you look capable, don't get me wrong, but... We've got this, don't worry. As a matter of fact, we've got someone who can practically shoot down flying zoogles with her eyes closed. <laughs> you mean Shion? I don't think she's going to appreciate you volunteering her for this. Well, if you think you can handle it, that'd be great. You'll, you'll find it flying around Trasilda Highway. Normally, it'll leave you alone, but if these a fight break out, that's when it swoops in to cause trouble. Meaning the only way to attract its attention is if we fight some other zoogles first. You've got it. It's a pain in the ass, for to be sure. But a clever pain in the ass at that. Alright, we're off to go hunt it. You better have that bounty ready when we get back. Of course, I'm a man of my word. Happy hunting. Alright. No, because it'll just pop up when we... Yeah, what, what's with this group and food? Alright, let's grab this other side quest first. This may just be the most beautiful, I mean, obviously, graphics-wise, the most beautiful city we've ever had in a Tales game. What's down there? I figured it would be surrounded by water, but no, you've got, like, forests and stuff down there. Wow. I'm just blown away. Uh, oh no. It's over here. Wait, is this the same guy? There's no way, right? It is him! Hey, are you okay? Wait, you're that foodie we ran to before, aren't you? Why, oh, hello there, Blazing Sword. I haven't seen you two since we were in... Si this was like an hour ago. Needless to say, I'm hungry. Again, Law, give the man some of those mushrooms you just picked. <laughs> you never learn anything, do you? What sort of wretched fungus are you trying to stuff down my throat? I don't know, I think they're pretty good. I wish I shared your unfound courage, my boy. Anyway, that's besides the point. I'm in... I'm here investing on important business. <laughs> Uh-huh, I'm sure. Though careful investigations of sneaking around, or through, I've acquired a top-secret recipe from none other palace itself. However, I'm short on ingredients. Yeah, 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 yeah. Back up below. What do we say about sneaking around? Before I answer that, tell me. Do you enjoy meat? Hell yeah, I do. Who doesn't? Well, the recipe I pilfered is none other than beef stew, a first-rate dish that is all about its meat. So you did steal the recipe, is what you're saying. So what if I did? Who cares? And what do you say? Will you get away in here or not? Alpha, I'm pretty sure this guy's breaking the law. Mm -hmm. Eh? He only uncovered the recipe from the palace, so I don't think that makes him a criminal. <laughs> Precisely. I simply took what I learned from those snake eyes 
I saw in Sislodi and put it to use in the name of fine cuisine. Oh, lovely. Am I really carrying this? What I need is meat and potatoes, as well as mushrooms and tomatoes. You'll get this for me, won't you? We'll be back with those ingredients, yeah. From what I understand, there's a ranch somewhere in Elder Nazi. You should see if what... Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you already know there's a ranch, why don't you visit it yourself? Because I can't well sneak off with a cow on my own, can I? Who said anything about stealing a cow? <laughs> I'm kidding, boy. I'm merely too hungry to be walking around now. Don't take too long now. That implies that it's been at least days, if not weeks, since we've seen this guy. Surprise, you say. Uh, I think what I want to do, though, is I want to check out this Coliseum. Or training grounds, as they're calling it. Alright, well, whatever this is, we can't do anything with it. We're under orders to keep this gate sealed. Not like there's much to see before you reach the next realm over, anyway. Just a little pond. It's the Reign and Armored Soldier's job to uphold order in the city. The Guardsmen can't hold a candle to us. We're not like the other insurgents. Alright, well, I guess we'll, uh... So we obviously can't go anywhere there. So I wonder if the training grounds is maybe on the other side? I didn't really pay attention to see if she told us, like, which direction it was. I doubt it's down here. This feels so far out of the city. この国の yeah, but considering he becomes one of our party members, we're obviously not going to kill him. Okay, I guess we're not lying there. We're not going through here either. Which means my, I guess, uh... Oh, okay, that's the training grounds. I mean, we can, we can knock out the training grounds at least, so let's do that. I say knock it out, but we're probably not going to be able to do all of it. I wonder if... Because I know there's a cameo battle. I All I've heard about the cameo battle is that it's the, the most spectacular cameo battle we've ever had. I don't know what that means. But uh, I wonder if this is where it's going to take place. So uh, I guess we'll see. So I think this is the this is it, right? Okay, we're here. Now what? Welcome to the training grounds, the pride of descent. If you're looking for the place to take your train to the next level, you've come to the right place. We embrace anybody who walks through our doors, so as long as you want to improve yourself, you'll always have a place to train here. I can already tell from looking at you all that you don't simply want to improve either. You want to be the best at what you do, am I right? Step right up and throw down the gauntlet. We'll be happy to put you through your paces. 
Um, who needs explanations? Uh, we'll do solo battle, Alfin. Oh, and you get rewards for the different ones you do. Okay. Recommended level. 25, 40, and then Alfin training. All right, let's do Alfin training, I guess. Uh, step one, okay. All right, what do you got? Oh, I gotta be careful with that, because, uh, I don't have, uh, my healing lady here. Wait, what? There's more than one? Okay. Can I, uh... Okay, and you can't use items either, so you have to win this in one shot. So it's training. So this is what people wanted. You know, the people that were like, oh, uh, you know, I don't have a place to practice combos, blah, 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 blah. This is literally, other Tales games don't have this. You literally have exactly what you wanted. <laughs> I don't think we're beating this, though. <laughs> I'm just gonna try until I lose. Oh, there we go. Your opponent is never your greatest threat. It's pride and complacency. It looks like you still have some training to do. Yeah. Well, uh, clearly I wasn't ready to do that. Alright, well, we'll save that for another time then. Because <laughs> we're clearly not ready for that. It was a uh, interesting experience at least, though. But uh, I think this is a good stopping point. I think next time we'll... Uh, well, let's see. What are the side quests that we can handle? Let's take a look real quick. Um, we have to get the Granite Fangs. Uh, take down the Great Dragon, which we're probably going to save for a bit. Because uh, I don't think we're high enough for that yet. Uh, the Gourmet. So we need some beef and we need some potatoes. So... I guess we'll do that one, and then we'll do this one, for sure. 
Uh, so we'll do those next time, and then we'll move on with the story. And then, you know, when we can do the other ones, we'll handle those. But that's going to be it, guys. Let me know what you guys think down below. I'm so happy to be in this beautiful city. Uh, don't forget to subscribe for more if you're new to the channel. I'll see you all next time. Have a wonderful day, everyone.